So I'm here at Dugard today in Hove. I'm going to take a look at this machine, which is the X5800, launched last year. It's a huge heavy-duty five-axis machine. I'd be interested to know your thoughts on this. Comment uh, below on YouTube. Tell us what you think of the machine and tell us whether you think I'm right on some of the features that we pick out. The first thing would have to be the construction and how this machine is built. This is a gantry-style uh, five-axis machine. The mach machine structure here is key. I think the first thing to point out is the Y-axis and how it has uh, a dual driving system with four linear guideways, which means it's, it, its strength and its stability when it's moving in that axis helps you uh, when you're machining harder materials and trying to remove metal and also for longevity as well. I also like the fact that the x-axis moves from left to right with a spindle which means wherever you're machining on that five axis table you're going to get equal rigidity throughout the, uh, the machining process. Now the table here is obviously supported on, on both sides, it's dual drive, you've got a, a full 360 degree c-axis this also means by having it obviously supportive both sides going, uh, I suppose, in harmony with what I mentioned on the y-axis means you get the complete, uh, the complete rigid construction that you'd expect for machining parts like you can actually see on this machine here. Also, uh, another good point I picked up on is actually it's got a 32 station tool changer, but you can actually have the option to have uh, two of those on this machine. So you'd, you could go actually up to 64 tools. Now we've all had those jobs where you wish you had more tools in your tool changer. Well then th there is the option here to buy this machine with 64 tool stations. Uh, both the A and the C axis have uh, torque motors so you've got plenty of power there in your axis movement as well as of course your spindle. Now these are uh, actually Kessler built spindles and I, I just picked up a bit on the brochure here where it actually says that the German-made Kessler built-in spindle has torque overload protection, thermal growth compensation and anti-thermal expansion, uh, vibration monitoring and anti-collision features. Now how fascinating is that from a spindle? Um, you know, we, we all worry when we're machinists about how long spindles are going to last, what the quality of the spindle is. Uh, that can obviously affect the, the final result of the part that you're machining. Now, you can be assured here with a, with a spindle like that that you're not going to, uh, well, you're getting the best value you can for your, uh, for your money with a spindle. Now, just to finally touch on a couple of points about the actual machine size, which we haven't yet, uh, one of the things that jumps out at me is it's a 20,000 kilogram machine. I mean, it's absolutely uh, huge, certainly, certainly built to last. And you've actually got 800 millimeters in the x-axis or 900 or 1050 millimeters in the y. Uh, obviously, you need that bit of travel for the tool changer. And the z-axis is 650 mil. Uh, max table load, interesting one, 1300 kilograms on that. And of course, you can move all the axes uh, while you've got 1300 kilograms on the table. And it's actually, it's not slow either. With a machine of this size, you might think, well, you might have to compromise a bit in speed. 48 meters a minute, and that table will actually rotate uh, at 80, uh, 80 RPM. Oh, sorry, 100 RPM, would you believe? And it is, uh, the spindle we mentioned, we talked about its makeup and its build, but it is actually an 18,000 RPM spindle as well on an HSK 63 back end with 35 kilowatts of power. Uh, I need not say much more about this machine really. I'll touch briefly on the Heidenhain control. There are options on the control as well. There are other options on the machine through spindle coolants, probing and all the rest of it. These are things that can be can be added but as you would expect it comes with all the um, thermal growth compensation, everything you'd expect from a, mach a machine, a high precision quality five axis machine. Um, brand new to Dugard last year, available in stock here at Hove. Uh, you can come and have a look. Oh, I must just say as well, that roof concertina's back, so when you're loading the parts on this machine, you can do it via a craneage, which is, uh, gives, makes it easy for you. And that's what this is about, making it easy for the operator, uh, easy for the program of the Hayden Hain control, um, and easy for the maintenance men, because you've got a machine here that's built to last, from Dugard.com.